How's it going, P NPC Nation? Welcome back to a brand new video. And this video is going to be one of the most controversial, like, topics I ever talk about. Because, I'll tell you, first off, I don't really don't get into politics on this channel that much. But, you know, the recent things that have been happening in politics have been kind of making me mad. So I wanted to make a video on it. Uh, if you don't, it's my opinion... If you don't like my this video, go ahead and subscribe because this is going to be controversial as hell. Uh, like, it's not going to be what uh, political system I'm on, like what party I I uh, like the best. It's just going to be my opinion, okay? Um. So, and plus, if you don't like this video, well, I didn't get to vote in 2016 because I'm not old enough. So, I can't do nothing about it. So, but, what I'm going to say in this video might piss a lot of people off, but, you know, I'm just going to say it right now. If you don't like this video, go ahead, press the unsubscribe button, because I don't know what I'm going to, you know, most controversial video. So, if you haven't been listening, if you watch, if you're into politics like I am, First off, I think our president, before I get into this video, I think our president is doing a good job as our president. I think he's he's trying to be president. So, if you haven't heard, they're trying to have impeachment hearings on President Trump and trying to impeach him for doing his job. What, but, you're saying NPC, he talked to a foreign leader to investigate Joe Biden. First off, if you guys have heard his transcript or read his transcript... He said nothing about Joe Biden in his whole entire transcript. Because the House Representatives, if you watch the news, have never, ever got his transcript. They didn't let him release it, so they decided, in my opinion, they decided to make... If you don't know what this video is about, this is about Trump's impeachment hearing. And the, the impeachment hearings are so freaking dumb... Like, they, the Democrats since, in my opinion, the Democrats since 2016 have not left Trump alone for three years. Since he got elected three years ago, they have not le left him alone. They won't let him be president, basically. They won't let him try to run the country. In my opinion, am I a Trump supporter? I support the president. I respect the president because he's the president. That's what I'm going to say about that. I support the, what the president, it, how the president is trying to run the country. Like, he's trying to run, at least he's trying to be president. But do, uh, but listen, the president's job is to try to make, is to run the US, United States, right? And he's trying to get us allies with Ukraine. You can say the Ukraine president's super controversial and all that and, not a good per person. Well, first off, we don't know who the UK... We don't even know anything... Except his name's Linsky. But we don't know anything about him. Like, how he is as a person. So, the president's job is to talk to foreign leaders about... Ally... Uh, treaties and all that other stuff. Making allies and... All that. And to help them, support them. And that's what Trump's trying to do, in my opinion. And Nancy Pelosi's like... All these people... That claim they've heard. There's no way all those people heard his phone call. I don't think anyone is allowed to hear his phone call. Except his White House staff. Were those people White House staff? Hell no. One was a former advisor before. Didn't they say before the phone call was even happened she was fired? So... She testified a couple of days ago as the former Ukraine uh, ambassador to Ukraine. But before that, bef they, she got fired before the Ukraine call even happened. So, how the heck did she testify for the Ukraine call? If she got fired before the Ukraine call, how the hell did she testify on the Ukraine call? So that's, that's super weird. All these other people are just Democrats that they want to 
say they heard something, heard Trump say that, so they can get more votes. But if you actually read the tran, if they actually read the actual transcript, they would find nothing, in my opinion, nothing that says investigate Biden. He has his own, the president, Zelensky can investigate him if he wants to. Hunter Biden has a company in Ukraine. Joe Biden's even admitted, if you watch the old, if you watch the uh, video of him saying, no, no one's going to get that money if the ambassador's not fired, because the, he's not fired. Well, if the representative, he said something about allowance of, no one's going to get the fucking money. If that bitch isn't fired. So, Joe Biden said that, okay? And that they have, Ukraine has some shifty st- stuff going on in there. I'll admit it, it has some shifty stuff going on. And Hunter Biden has his own company in Ukraine. So if it's in Ukraine, don't the, vi- don't the president of Ukraine have the right to have an investigation on Hunter Biden and Joe Biden if they have a company in their country? I think they do. I think, I think they do. If they have a company in Ukraine, I don't know if they have a company in Ukraine. I haven't heard about that, but I heard they had something in Ukraine. So have, if they have something in Ukraine, it's the right of that president to have an investigation to make sure it's not shifty shit going on, you know? But what, what I'm trying to say is, in my opinion, the president of these United States, Donald John Trump, is trying his best to be president and actually talking to Ukraine. Because we had financial aid with them, trying to strike a deal with them, giving them financial aid, giving them money. We're so much money in, we're so much money in debt and all that other stuff. And Trump's actually trying to strike a deal with other foreign leaders, like, he, like his job is... Because, uh, one, they're just mad because he's never ha- held political office before. And two... The Democrats lost last election. So they're just pissed off still. Because they want to be president still. They, they held the office for eight fucking years. That's understandable. If you want to keep the office for eight more fucking years, you know? For 16 years. I know you want to keep the office for a total of 16 years. In my opinion, the Democrats are just still pissed off because Trump won the election in 2016. And they want to say all this, uh, all this shit. And Ru- if Russia got into... If Russia got into the election, if they hacked election votes, and they're bringing it up now, they, they, they hacked the election in 2016, why is he president? He's not, he, he is president because Russia did not hack the fucking election votes. Because the Electoral College gets to vote on who is the president. If you don't know how the fucking government works, Nancy Pelosi, why the fuck are you our speaker of the house. You shouldn't be speaker of the damn house. If you don't understand. If you get, if the Democrats want to bring up. The. The. Re, saying Trump. Russia got into the elections. And Trump's trying to rig this election. No. he Russia can't get into election votes. It can't rig the fucking election. If the electoral college. Which I still think they vote a piece of paper. They write down the votes on a piece of paper and vote, and vote for the president. If you don't understand, that's how the president's fucking picked. And sorry if my mic fell, my mic fell out of my ear. <laughs> sorry about that. But never mind that, Nancy Pelosi. If you don't understand how the president's fucking picked, get the fuck out of office. Am I, am I trying to support Republicans? No, I'm trying to state fucking facts. You guys want to bring up that? You guys want to bring up he? investigated, if there's, if, if he's asking the Ukraine president to investigate Joe Biden for, because he's running for president, no, Joe Biden, Hunter Biden, has a company, they've admitted, they have a company, they have, I don't know if, they, if it's even a company, they have something in Ukraine, so, that's the president's right of Ukraine to investigate him anyways, if they're, if they're corrupt as fuck over there, if you, if you want to say Ukraine's corrupt as hell, and they have a damn company in Ukraine, 
So Joe, Hunter Biden has a company or something in Ukraine. That could be corruption as well. They could use that ties to run, to become president. In my opinion, the Democrats just don't want a businessman or someone that knows what they're doing to run for president, to be, or to run the country. Trump's trying to actually run this country. I'm not going to say if he's doing a good job or a bad job. I think he's do. well, I'll say it actually, because this video is controversial as hell. He's doing a good job, in my opinion. Let, let the man be president, okay? Let the man be fucking president. Let him run for pre- let him be president. He did, in my opinion, in the transcript, he talked nothing. They read the transcript at one of the hearings. It didn't mention, it, it, they, day one call, didn't mention anything. Day two call, probably didn't mention anything. They haven't read day two call. I don't know if they read day two. I stopped watching this shit because this shit pisses me off. Let the man be president, okay? If you let the man be president, he might actually get something. He can get stuff done. He's got stuff done because he made jobs and all that other stuff. Unemployment's been awesome. It went down a lot. Let the man be fucking president, okay? Let him run the damn country. Stop having this damn witch hunt and saying, oh, Russia, back in 2016, Russia rigged the elections. Oh, he's trying to investigate the Bidens. Why don't you investigate the fucking Bidens yourself and see what the fuck's going on? And you never investigated Hillary. You said when she was running for president, when she had that 3,000 emails, I'll bring back facts. They, when the when election was over, they said they was going to reopen the case on Hillary Clinton. They never fucking did. Let Trump be president, okay? This is my opinion on the impeachment. It's dumb. It's super dumb because the man's trying to run the country and he can't do that when he's stressing. And, and then they're bringing up some dumbass news like, oh, Trump had a heart attack. Like, he went to the hospital. Every president has to have a physical. It's what the part of their duties. They have to have a physical. And this impeachment is... I know this video is going to give me a lot of hate, but this impeachment is bullshit. Okay? This impeachment is bullshit. I just wanted to make this video because it's my opinion. And first off, this isn't meant for kids. It's my opinion, and I just wanted to have my opinion on this because it's been pissed me off that he's trying to make allies, trying to... Make a deal with Ukraine, and then they're like, oh, he said something about the Bidens. He's running for president. Impeach him No, Like, okay, he could talk about anybody he wants. Does it mean they're good? Did the Ukraine actually bring up an investigation on the Bidens? No. Did he ask him to investigate the Bidens? No. In my opinion, he didn't do that shit. Let the man be fucking president, okay? Uh, this video is going to give me so much hate. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, press the share button. Press the like button. Press the red channel. Subscribe button. Press the bell so you know if I have time I upload a video. I'll see you guys next video. If you didn't like it, I don't know, go ahead and unsubscribe.